last week, I took a little walk in my neighborhood. I saw something cool. It was a solar system that was drawn out on the sidewalk with chalk. And I really liked it. Shot a one shot 50 second video, put it up on LinkedIn where I have like 7,000 followers and also put it up on TikTok at the same time and promptly forgot about it. And then a week later, I check into TikTok and that one simple 50 second video that I posted with only a thousand followers or something on TikTok now has 303,000 views. So if I dive down a little bit more into my analytics, I see that people have liked it 75,000 times over 75,000 times. It's got 535 comments and 217 shares. The total playtime on it is 3,400 hours roughly. The total views have been 303. The average watch time, 40 seconds on a 50 second video. And I see that it's reached an audience of mostly people in the United States and English speaking countries. And there are other statistics that I can dive into on it. But I remember this is kind of an allegory because in 2006, 2007 time frame, I posted my first YouTube video. And within a few months, YouTube contacted me and said, hey, your video is doing really well. Do you want to share revenue on advertising for it? And I said, okay, sure. Didn't think too much about it. And long story short, that video has over 2 million views. And for the first year, that revenue was about 30K for a video that I just kind of shot in my spare time and put up to YouTube in five or 10 minutes. <laughs> and it earned income for about five or six years before it finally petered off. And I'm thinking some of these early day sort of things where we start to see really big numbers, they don't seem real. And if I had to do it all over again with YouTube, you better believe I would have invested more in video and built a better audience at YouTube because I'm nowhere with YouTube right now. I'll post things there, but I know there's no way I'm going to get another video that's going to hit millions and millions of people like that. But looking for some of these new opportunities like TikTok that I'm not taking seriously, maybe I need to take them more seriously or maybe I don't. Let me know what you think.